Hey guys, it's King Eight One Eighty Five. Um, episode two of Barnyard. So in the last episode, we got here, did I don't know how many missions? I think like yeah, I have no idea. Um, and then this episode, we're gonna do a few more. So we're gonna start off with I believe this is the mini game. Finally, if you saw the last episode, I kind of messed up and thought that Pig had a mini game, but it was just a mission, and it was pretty much tutorial last episode. So chat with Pig. Let's all jump in the mud. Isn't that more of a pig thing than a cow thing? Don't tell me you're scared of getting all little mud on your cowhide. It's fun. We s we spin the water pump around. When it comes your way, you can jump it over it with B or kick it with A. Last animal standing wins. Want to try? So this is probably one of my f watch and learn. This is probably a really fun mini game. I it's, it's probably the most simple, but it's. It's pretty fun. So you can either kick the thing or jump. I might take a few times since I haven't really played it on using, well, yeah. I haven't played it in a while, so I might be a little bad on mini games. Very intense. I'm just looking to win. Not to get like, the best score. Oh, that was really tough. I don't know if it was even really. Oh gosh, there's gonna be a close one. Oh, I'll redo that. Yeah. What did I get? Bad luck. I got an F. So yeah, try again. Okay, this time hoping I can do much better. I did okay in the beginning, but then I went downhill. You just get stuck, and it's really tough to kick it away or jump after when you get to the point. I did not mean to do that, but okay. I'm so used to like every GameCube game, A being jump, so. Sorry that took my second try, but I think I did okay there. So after each mini game, they usually tally up your points and everything. So I got 90, and then I got great. There's um F. I think there's a D. I think there's C. I know there's B. There's A, and then there's star. So let's see. Then there's always a leaderboard. Yeah. There's see. There's the star with Pig because he's the best. Um. So yeah, that's pretty cool. There's leaderboards and everything. So that was our first money mini game. Um, so yeah, there's always like a little tip or help right here, but after you start playing, you really don't need it. And again, there are kind of long loading screens, but I don't know, it's better than Skyrim. All right. For a cow, you make a pretty good pig. Drop our pig sty anytime if you want to play Mud Jumpers or more. You'll see a floating star icon. That means you can play a game over. Sounds good. See you in the mud. Time to go to work. So, as he just said, oh wow, I guess go for bucks. See, now it might take a second to load. Hmm. Like, that's weird. Yeah, I think I have to come back or something, or like leave and join again or quit the game or whatever. But then you can go back to him and play whenever you want. So, chat with Hannah. Look at what? Root lost the eggs all over the yard. 
There are still ten eggs missing, and if we don't find them, the raccoons will. Can you help me? Sure I can. That was a kind of close-up of King. Okay, so now let's run around and pick up all the eggs. They're pretty easy to find since there's like a star halo above them. Yeah, I would keep running, but I'm gonna let my run recharge. So yeah, B in this game is jump. That gets kind of annoying, but... Let's see if there's anything. Oh, no, but here I believe is another recipe. Chocolate mousse, okay. Not extremely important right now. Nothing right there. Good root just walking around like nothing. Um, well, there's one. And over here is two. Seven. Eight. Oh, we can go up here. Nothing up here, though. Um. Nine. Hmm, where's ten? Where did we not really go on? Yeah, there we go. So that's ten eggs. Let's get back. Over to Hannah. Give her back. Thank you. I should have introduced myself. Well, hello there. I'm Hannah. That's weird. They started the. Never mind. Hey, Hannah. I'm King. Nice to meet you, and thanks. Now I can rest for easy. If you'd ever like to get some more eggs for yourself, come to the chicken coop and press A on the ramp. Feel free to take one one egg per day. Thanks. Bye now. 50 gold for bucks. And we did our second mission. Okay. So now... Sorry, I exited out of full screen and now I'm just putting it back. Uh, okay. Press A to chat with Ben. Third, well, not a third. I'm not even going to count the missions, but it's time for you to learn how to fight, fight. It's our responsibility to make sure that no animal is harmed on this side of the fence. To keep the promise, we have, been, we have to be ready. I saw you fooling with Otis before. Let's see how good your squirting really is. I've planted targets around the barnyard. If you run out of milk, run to a, run to a milk refill to recharge yourself. You have to go around three times and squirt milk on all of the targets before your timer runs out. We call it sharp squirting. Do you want to give it a try? Not really, but sure thing. So yeah, before mini games, they give you the instructions, and if it's not a mini game or if it's something else, then they'll just give you a random tip or trick. Same clip we saw in the beginning of the game, but now with my person. Okay, so let's let's go. Oh, I guess the farther along we, the farther away we shoot at it. So yeah, we can lock on to things. Still three more. Or does it give me more for shooting far away? No, I don't think so. Level one clear, that was pretty darn easy. The homing effect that we can just lock on makes it much easier. I don't think this will work. No. Can 
gonna make it all the wow, wait. No, sorry. I thought I could make that. Ooh, okay, so. Still. That was pretty easy. Level two cleared. So then we immediately start level three. Got a lot more. Oh, wait, I'm actually gonna position this so I can get both. I just know that I'm gonna get it. So I don't know if that was the very end. I think there's three rounds. I think that was the end. That was our second mini game. Can shot. I shot 23 accuracy. I didn't really care about that. But that was 31. Oh wow. So I think I got. Oh well, there's a lot of stars, but I got third. It's not that bad. For my first. Well, first try of the let's play. Barnyard, how to use sunglasses, so yeah. So a lot of these things will be repeats and stuff you already know and you don't need to know, but still. Well done. Keep up your training. One day you may need it for real. I'll be ready. I think you will be. You seem like a sensible kind of cow. Here. Have this, the key to the barnyard gate. All right. Be careful out there. So yeah, he trusts me for a key to the barnyard. So really quickly, well, no, I'm not gonna do that right now. So the cool thing about this game, yeah, see there's a star now. The cool thing about this game is it actually turns night and day, you know, so that's cool. So let's check our cell phone. Otis wants to meet me in the barnyard. Yeah, and now I got another one. No, it's, wait, what? Oh, it's nearly sundown, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, so yeah, it automatically makes us sleep, I think, the first night. Or maybe every night. So yeah, it just showed him getting home. Oddly, there is no, like, accidentally blow your cover missions with him, I don't think. You know, like, it's night and you have to get away from him before the farmer sees you. But I don't think there is one. So yeah, we can sleep through night, which is pretty cool. And you have to sleep, and because then it'll let your stamina work better. So if you don't sleep and stay up the nights, then your stamina gets really low and you can barely run. So saving and memory card slot A. Okay, so we have 111. Yep, it's probably Otis again. Yep, it's Otis. Yeah, let's chat with Otis. Looking good. Back at you, Otis. I can't believe you beat the pigs at Mud Jumpers. You could be a contender for Barnyard Champion. Tell me more. We're always playing games here in the Barnyard, and we keep track of everyone's best results. Every time you get a record, you'll receive a letter grade. If you get a really high score, you'll get a star. You can check your high scores on, the, on your scorecard. The animal with the most stars in the Barnyard is the champion. That would be me. I might have guessed. Pip keeps the record. See him if you want to know any more about how many star um, stars. I thought I could get through that without. See him if you want to know how many stars everyone has. Watch out, Otis. You might lose that trophy real soon. We'll see. If you're gonna beat my records, you'll need this bike. You can have my bike key. I don't ride anymore. Not since Miss Beady saw me. Press A to pedal and L to brake. Press B if you want to jump. And press L. That's not L, is it? No. Press X. Well, right. Well. Press X while turning to do a slide. Go on. Take it for a spin. So we got a scorecard and we got a bike key. And the bike is extremely important and extremely fun. So that's probably my favorite part of the barnyard. So let's just test this bike out really quickly. So we hold A to go, it's pretty cool. And then we press um, 
we hold down the R to go fast. And then B to jump. And L to slide. So let's see what we can do here. Oh wait, I forgot to put the key. Will it automatically open? No. We press X to get off. No, we don't. We press Y to get off. So we open the barnyard. Okay. That was pretty cool. So yeah, I'm not gonna go that way because that's not spoilers, but it'll, I don't know, it'll just, we can do that when the mission, when time comes. So, you also can buy, um, there are four bikes in the entire game, I believe. But the scary thing is if you buy a bike besides this one, I think you can't get this one back. So yeah, you can crash. Um, and then here's some more gates we can't open. Um, we, that was a bad idea. So, um, thanks for watching episode two of Barnyard. I'd say we got a good amount done for just getting out of tutorial. It's kind of weird if you saw that anyway. Oh, whatever, but thanks for watching.